Though woken at midnight, the soft push of the tide, the stale smell of salt and men, and the overwhelming excitement of battle, but I suppose it's a thin line between fear and excitement. The moon was setting and vanished from the turkey skies at 3 a.m. At 3.40, Admiral Thursday uttered the words that began events that began a legend. Go ahead and land. In the bow of the lead boat, one like this, was Duncan Chapman of Maryborough. Moments before the mayhem would begin, he jumped from the boat and became by tradition the first Anzac upon those sands, sands that would feel the hug of death for many months. The wonderful folk of Maryborough are very proud and have erected a fine dedication to Duncan with rocks from the cove, brought over thanks to the Turkish government. And within those rocks are the souls and dreams of a generation. Many brave young men from a growing great country and I reckon Duncan would be proud.